measure to prevent pneumonia is one, is to make sure that you get in touch with your doctor when you're having cough, fever, or any any respiratory symptoms as early as possible. Don't wait for two to three weeks before going to the doctor. Then the second of all is, if you're prone to develop actually like flu every year, we advocate giving flu medication because having flu actually is one, one factor that you can have a pneumonia because your resistance will get low. Then the third part is actually advocating pneumococcal vaccine. Actually, international guidelines say 65 years old and above, you get vaccination for pneumonia. But in Philippines, there's a recent study that was done that it's better that the lower age group that you initiated the pneumococcal vaccine, like 55 years old, especially for those smokers, mas maganda yung effect niya throughout the year. Kasi pneumococcal vaccine, unlike the flu vaccine, uh, actually will not prevent you to develop pneumonia. But actually, in the cases that you develop pneumonia, it will not be severe enough for you to get admitted in the hospital and get really sick. So, and um, and this kind of, of uh, pneumococcal vaccine is actually being advocated to some of my patients with asthma, with chemotherapy, uh, with diabetes, wherein the immune system are really low. Then another form to prevent asthma is actually the number one list is to prevent smoking because smoking will destroy your lung structure and your lung structure is important to preventing actually formation of phlegm para mag, mag progress to pneumonia. Because normally the problem with pneumonia is phlegm accumulation. So phlegm accumulation per se, if you don't have the necessary mechanism para ilabas yung phlegm, then you get prone to have a pneumonia.